What's up, everyone? It's Chris from PickDogs.com here with your pre-pick in the Las Vegas Raiders versus Minnesota Vikings NFL preseason matchup going down Friday, August 14th, 2022. Before we get to that free pick, gotta let you guys know at PickDogs.com, we're doing it bigger and better than anyone else. Got more free pick videos on our channel than you'll find anywhere else on YouTube, so make sure you're subscribed and also take advantage of our free sportsbook bonus offer. The link in the description of this video below. Also in the description of this video below, click that join button for more information on our YouTube VIP package. Great way to get yourself some premium content for a great price. Yeah, the VIP pass, just over three bucks a day, gets you premium picks from myself and Mitch, as well as add-on plays and player props that we like just as much. The uh, the premium pass, still 50 bucks a month, just over a buck 50 a day, but you're still getting 70 to 80 plays on average per month. Sometimes you get those VIP premium combo shows thrown in there as well on days where you have smaller cards, so definitely take advantage of it. Whatever route you go, it's definitely worth it because football season just around the corner. And as good as the long-term deals are at Pick Dogs Premium, you're not going to get a Capper's monthly pass or the two-for-one Capper promotion for 50 or 100 bucks a month. But you got Mitch and I giving you plays every single day with that VIP and premium pass. So definitely take advantage of that. But let's get to this one between the Las Vegas Raiders and the Minnesota Vikings. For the Minnesota Vikings, the big news being obviously no Kirk Cousins for this game as Kirk Cousins did get COVID, leaving the uh, play-calling duties split between Sean Mannion and and Kellen Mond, obviously Mannion from his time with the Los Angeles Rams, does have some experience. And Kellen Mond, a guy that I'm personally excited to see what he has in store at the at the professional level here after his time at Texas A&M. And, um, you know, we've seen that, you know, Mannion, like I said, has the experience. And Mond is a big game player from playing. You know, he's, he's taken on Alabama. He's taken on Auburn. He's taken on the big boys in college. But now he has to make that next step. Now, the thing for me in this one, though, is that you look up and down the depth chart for the, uh, the Minnesota Vikings and anybody who's watched my videos in the preseason so far knows how much I value depth in preseason betting. There's not a ton here. You know, the the the, uh, the Vikings will likely put uh, Dalvin Cook and Justin Jefferson out as well as Adam Thielen for, you know, a few, at least a couple series, get their legs underneath them. And Alexander Madison, not a bad option in the Minnesota backfield. But after that, you know, there's still not a, uh, not a ton to be excited about in terms of depth for the Minnesota Vikings. There is still, you know, some solid pieces on defense, but again, there's just, you know, a lack of depth for me, and and you know, it, it doesn't make the uh, the Vikings easy to back, especially without, you know, their starting quarterback for at least a couple series where you could do some damage and give yourself a chance with some early points that, when you're getting them in in, in an underdog role in the preseason, could be very valuable. But on the other side, you got the Las Vegas Raiders who, albeit didn't play their starters in the uh, in the Hall of Fame game, we saw the majority of the third and fourth string action. But still, those those lower depth uh, depth chart guys had a chance to shake off the rust, and now you get to see the Las Vegas Raiders use that to their advantage, have a game to shake off the rust, and now prep themselves for the rest of the preseason. You're going to see Derek Carr in the mix here, uh, you know, taking on some play calling duty. But what we've also seen was that Jarrett Stidham, a capable option, Nick Mullins, a capable option in a backup role, as well as Chase Garbers. You know, we're, we're going to see some, probably see some Josh Jacobs and Devontae Adams here, as well as Hunter Renfro, Keelan Cole. And I think you're going to want to bubble wrap those guys if you're the Las Vegas Raiders because you can ill afford to not have those guys on the field this season. But like I said, the advantage goes to the Raiders here just because they've had a game for those lesser string guys who are probably going to see the majority of the action here. I've already had a game to shake off that rust, and the Raiders looked pretty good, albeit against the Jacksonville Jaguars and their backups. But with not much else to go on here, I still lean towards the Las Vegas Raiders. I did like what I saw from them in the Hall of Fame game for the most part. And I think uh, they can get the job done here. Not my strongest play, especially you know, for the preseason. So I'll lean towards Las Vegas minus four in this one. That's going to be my free pick. But if you're looking for best bets for myself or any of our other world-class handicappers, check out Pick Dogs Premium and use this promo code here, AUG15, A-U-G-1-5. All one word, all lowercase, 15% off your purchase at Pick Dogs Premium. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and drop a like. Let's cash some winners.